More residents will be able to be treated locally instead of travelling to Brisbane, with a new ward open today at Nambour Hospital. But the opposition says it's not enough, with ambulance ramping and increasing concern at all Sunshine Coast hospitals. Nambour Hospital is hoping three's a charm. It's new Block 3, that is. One, two, three. The Health Minister officially opened the ward that's been operating for a few weeks. Costing $150 million, there's 9,600 more metres of floor space and 96 additional beds. The services include a bigger outpatient department and general medicine wards. We have an expanded special nursery clinic. There's about 2,000 babies born uh, every year here at the Nambour General Hospital. The hospital will need more staff to man the facilities. 240 will be employed with $26 million in funding over the next four years. And when it's eventually linked with the university hospital... 95% of the healthcare needs of the local community will be able to be met locally. It's hoped the expansion will help with ambulance ramping problems. About 45% of the people who present actually get admitted to hospital. That's why the, the, the building of the 96-bed block was justified. But today, local hospitals were full, even with the new beds. QAS units on air. This is the Common Core to advise that Nambour and Caloundra are on capacity. Thank you. The state opposition says these 96 beds still aren't enough to cope with the region's growth. But the government says more expansions are on the way. The next phase is also an expansion uh, and redevelopment of the emergency department and a number of other associated areas. Shelley Doyle, 7 News.